LD needs to reset bracket on him. Um, so it means he needs to win two games. This is best two out of three, as it always is at Xanadu. You guys should be familiar with that by now. Um, yeah, Bark won winners. He's gotten really good at the Fox matchup. He's any any Fox that's not LDs, he's going to edge guard and he's going to take it out. Um, Boom came a couple weeks ago. Fox is a glass can. It's the way Bark, game Bark I think, three stocked um, Boom's, Boom's Fox as well. Uh, so LD's really the only Fox I see. Maybe Isaiah, too, that can take out Bark. Um, yeah, even Boom himself said uh, his Fox was a problem. Yeah. Straight from the horse's mouth. Oh, Mark goes for the the nair there again. I don't think that was smart. I think he should have just done an up air. The nair is going to hit it that high above, so you kind of get the up air to just hit, hit Fox. It's not going to kill Fox, but it hits him again. You grab the ledge, you jump off. Game three LD. So, um, V's calling a game three for LD. He thinks he's going to win game three. Um, Mark he said that Mark wants to be the number one, but. In LD. fact, if, if Bark wins this, LD um, is the king of the castle. if Bark actually wins this castle. tournament, he will become number the one. number one. The ranks aren't correct. It's actually Bark's ranked number the two. LD won't be able to um, for a week. Bark like. will become the number one seed in Xanadu, and LD will be the number, oh. the number two seed. So yeah, Bark needs to win this year. Uh, he will overtake LD as the one seed in Xanadu. He's got a strong two-stock lead. Uh, those strong leads can actually turn to not to deficits against a uh, good fox. Like LD, so just zero to death you. He gets the right touch and it's a, it's a combo to jab up smash. Are we losing audio? This thing keeps he going just out. keeps turning it up and on. <laughs> okay. No, I didn't want that forward smash. Oh, he's really good on the on the ledge, like baiting people into um, approaching off the ledge, the way he wants to set up for the correct attack or the edge rate. Uh, he knows he doesn't get too greedy with his approaches. Um, so they are good edge hog by Bark. Bark's gonna be uh, up three one here. This is what we saw happen in uh, winners finals, and Bark took it. Oh. Yeah. Those were nice. That was a nice uh, oh, reverse like back it. airs by LD to get that on Smash. <laughs> and like oh, it. so the three-one lead by Bark and LD doesn't take a touch. He's takes zero percent damage. In two stocks, uh, that's the first hit Bark's gotten on him since he took the last stock on LD. <laughs> and now LD in a commanding, not commanding, it's still only one stock. Last time you stage. said that, this happened. And Bark got him! Literally, last time you said that, Bark that got him! <laughs> Commentator's curse, that's what, that's what LD gets for coaching every one of my opponents. I'm going to commentate a curse him every time. So uh, game one goes to Bark after LD bark, bark, nearly bark, brought bark, it back. Bark. Like I said, Bark's LD hungry coach for that Dark number Horse, one. Bark. Be hungry for that number one. Master hand job. He scores every one of my opponents, so I kind of want Bark to take this. Bark needs to just win one more to eliminate LD here and not drop the game, which would actually put him pretty yep, high. Once, once he wins this so game, for, LD for will be power rankings, we use, uh, ELO eliminated rankings forever. It's just uh, a website where you can make your own rankings based off you know, the, ELO, um, the ELO rating system. Um, so the winning a set and losing a set... You know, if, you, if Bark drops this game and wins, you know, set two, it's going to affect his ELO differently. Um, so he definitely wants to win this right here, just outright 2-0. Uh, winners finals in the first set of grand finals. Because um, it'll give him a bigger boost. So he'll definitely take the one. 
definitely take the number one overall card rankings, but um, he might not take as big of a lead as he would like if he, uh, if he drops this, this set. So if Barkin managed to win this set, he will take a very convincing lead over Has LD this been a long rankings. road and a goal of Bark to become number one? Yeah, he actually, he's, uh, he's been beating LD. Um, no, but I'm saying, is that like a goal for him? Or is he no, yeah, like, who doesn't want to beat number one? I mean, in this, in the past, since 2016 started, Bark, I think, is like two, two in one against uh, LD. He's won two out of three sets. Um, it might, even be, it might even be more. Yeah, Bark's done a pretty good job against LD. So he definitely wants to take this here. He's only, his ELO is only like, I don't know, ten, maybe 10 or something or 15 less than LD's. So this win here will definitely help him push him up if he can take it. Uh, LD's got a stock lead. He's got a uh, Bark in an edge guard position. Fox can be surprisingly good at edge guarding, edge guarding Pika. Bark with a single up B, he managed to avoid the, oh, good back here, avoid the jab by LD to uh, turn the stock back around and take it and uh, even it up here. So all LD needs is a back from the ledge, a jab up smash, he's got a lot of options, even it up here. But Bark could take this, oh, and he gets the back here, good job by Bark. So Bark now takes the stock lead, didn't take any damage on that stock there. Once he took that, the fourth, LD's fourth stock, he now took LD's third stock, now taking a hit, but... Good sweet spot, doesn't want uh, LD in a position to chase his recovery. <laughs> that back will take it. Alright, we're even up on two stocks apiece here. If Bark manages to win this game, he will have eliminated LD just for the second Let's time. See, time. Good back here. So Bark, Hedgehogs, and he, uh, he's now up 2-1. LD on his last tournament life. Is this going to be Xanadu for tonight? So be Xandu, we'll be able to go home in this uh, ice storm we're having. Probably can't even get out of the parking lot. Much less get into your car. Yeah, Joey's probably frozen shut. Folks comes away. from like 90 degree California to frozen ice storms in Baltimore. <laughs> okay. Oh, up smash. Like I said, oh, he gets the forward tilt. I think he wanted a pivot jab there. I just can't imagine that. a forward tilt into stage was what LD wanted. What a pivot jab on Smash Bros. It's going to go to game three, dog. LD is going to take. Alright, so now here we are. Last stock. LD brought it back. Only took 10% damage. Gets hit there. Barco from the grab. Gets him off stage. Yes. He oh. pushing up here. Does he get it? Oh, oh Bark going again, oh. and Bark gets it. Bark eliminates LD.